All right, we are now joined by St. John's head coach, Steve Lavin. Uh, coach, how are you feeling today? Of course, uh, taking on San Diego State. Um, we, are, we are going to be joined momentarily by oh. Steve Lavin, but that's okay. An interesting situation, obviously, with, uh, with St. John's at the moment, but there's no denying their talent. They've been talented since Lavin stepped into right. that, you know, that place and that role. It's just a matter of putting it together, and I think this is their best shot. So All right. Let's see what he has to say. I am, I am told now we have Coach Lavin. Coach, what was your uh, immediate reaction when you found out that St. John's will have San Diego State in the opening round? Well, number one, just pleased uh, for our seniors mm -hmm. who have worked so hard uh, to punch through and get St. John's back to the NCAA tournament. Uh, it's a group of five seniors all earn their degree, and uh, that's rare in this era. Uh, so pleased for them. You know, it's sure. a situation where I've been fortunate uh, to participate in 15 NCAA tournaments. You know, eight as a head coach, seven uh, as an assistant coach with stops at Purdue and UCLA and now St. John's. But just happy uh, for the young people in our program. As you guys know, Christmas Eve, you know, shaking the presents, um, or ripping, you know, the wrapping off the presents in the morning of Christmas. Yep. Uh, e Easter egg hunts, probably right up there. Halloween, but that childlike spirit uh, to experience it through young people's eyes is what it's all about in this business. So just happy for our seniors. Excellent. For me, it was Hanukkah, but it's okay. It's all the same. Oh, yes. it's all the yeah. same. Coach Lavin, yep. specific. And fairy too. <laughs> uh, you know, I, the first time the tooth fairy dropped a couple bucks under the pillow. Yeah, that was that was that was uh, kind of the entrepreneurial spirit moving forward from now on. I love that. appreciation barter huge, system. Yeah, huge Great night. Off. When you look at San Diego State specifically, obviously a terrific defensive team. How much do you know about the Aztecs? How much have you seen of the Aztecs? Obviously, you you pretty much could not be playing a school farther away from St. John. So, what do you know tonight? You know, Dwayne Poli uh, played for us, mm -hmm. transferred. He's had some health issues, but it was a uh, amicable, um, you know, split, and uh, we keep in touch with, with Dwayne and his family, and so it was a win-win situation. He's going to earn his degree, and they're in the NCAA tournament, were in the NCAA tournament as well, and got great respect uh, for Coach Fisher, uh, as well as Coach Dutcher, who's been his right-hand man for years, uh, and uh, we'll start to do our film work in terms of, uh, you know, preparation, and logistics uh, here tonight. Of course, we uh, had a nice send-off uh, rally, you know, enjoyed watching the selection show with the students on campus, mm -hmm. and we had some media, and then uh, jumped on the phone with you guys, and uh, now we'll start to, uh, you know, drill down on San Diego State, so we'll know much more in the morning, but I respect their program. They're in the NCAA tournament on a regular basis, and uh, I know they've got great size and length around the rim, so they present a real challenge for us. Coach, you won't have Chris Obekba for this game against San Diego State. How does that change your game plan or how you'll approach trying to beat San Diego State? Well, you know, it's unfortunate uh, that we won't have Chris mm -hmm. or Chris's services, but over the past three years, uh, this group of seniors has had to play uh, without Chris before, right. whether it was through injuries um, or, you know, fouling out of ball games uh, or stretches where we just chose to go small. Uh, press and uh, play with five guards, uh, kind of a small ball, Charlie Spoonhauer, Don Nelson of the, the NBA. Uh, we play that way often. I did at UCLA, and I've done it here. And so uh, not much phase of this group of seniors. That's one of the values of having an older group. Uh, so we like the quickness of our team. We like the skill, the scrappiness of our particular team. And yet we know San Diego State presents a real challenge, and most um, – concerning is their experience. They go to the NCAA tournament right. every year. We've been working to get St. John's back in the NCAA tournament. Uh, so that experience gives San Diego State an edge, but I like our kids as well. Uh, they play a tough schedule, number 23 in the country, uh, nine wins over top 100, mm -hmm. and a strong RPI, and, and playing well of late, winning 7 of 10. All right, Steve Lavin, thank you very much for your time, and good luck to you and St. John's as you make your way uh, into the NCAA tournament. Thanks, Coach. Okay, fellas, we'll do it again. Take yes. Care.